Hi guys, got a video here um, about the Wolf 7 RM BS lamp um, used in many collieries in the Brit in Britain um, and exported around the world. Um, this lamp on the left is um, from the last batch that Wolf made in 1990, I think it was. And uh, the lamp on the right is a Wolf model that was exported to South Africa uh, and it's built under license for Green and Sun, uh, this particular model. Um, the, the, the lamps are a flat wick lamp with a real lighter. Um, they've got um, a bottom shut off, um, air shut off, and they've got a middle air shut off. Um, used by mine officials, deputies, shot firers, overman managers um, from about the late 1930s onwards. Um, but um, the the one this one here, um, the South African version, used in coal mines and gold mines. Uh, a lot of people say, oh, there isn't any gas in gold mines, but uh, there's many South African gold mines that have had gas problems, and the officials there, the miners, shift bosses, uh, overseers, yeah. and whatnot, use these lamps daily. Um, this lamp has a port fitted here where um, the miners in South Africa would attach a rubber tube with a, a bulb that squeezes the sample in the test for gas in stokes and dry ridges and whatnot. Um, right, so let's um, let's take one of these lamps to bits and see how easy it is to um, strip down and rebuild. Now, like most wolves, or all wolves really, when you unscrew the bottom the glass will come out so that's one thing you have to be careful of with a wolf lamp so let's have a go at this so you can see when i'm unscrewing the, the glass is unscrewing as well with the gauze so i'll just take that out there just blow that out so you've got the fuel cell um you've got the lamp middle and the top um that's where the lock sits it's a magnetic lock and put the magnet there. This lock's been removed. Standard um, mild steel, uh, mild steel bonnet and whatnot. So you've got, as usual, you've got two gauzes. There's your outer gauze. There's your inner gauze. Wolf glass, sixty by sixty. I don't know if you can see the mine and quarries uh, stamp there. Right, so. You've got your flat wick there that's adjustable underneath and then you've got your spark, uh, your flint igniter to remove that you just unscrew the key there key comes out that's your complete ignition assembly there this part here is the under air feed so the air comes underneath into the flame and then on your fuel cell here, you've got a cap there. You can pull that cap off and you can see the the uh, wick adjuster um, spindle there. And then this thing here, and that's where you put the fuel. So you put a screwdriver in there and undo that and you can put your fuel in. So that's pretty much a wolf lamp. So to uh, reassemble it, you just put your uh, flint assembly there. That screws back in there. See that? And then you just turn that and it makes a spark. And then pop your glass on. Washer on the top. Little gauze. Big gauze. And then that just screws on there. And that is your Wolf 7 RMBS. Now, Wolf did uh, a few other versions of this. They did a workman's lamp um, with electronic uh, electric ignition. They did a, um, a lamp with just with a, a flat wick in it, and that was like a training school lamp or a special order lamp. But there's a few there's a few variations of this with the under with the under air feed and the middle air feed on it and whatnot. So yeah, so that is your Wolf um, Seven RMBS lamp. So. Um, I hope you enjoyed that video and watch out again soon for another video. Thank you. Bye for now.